If there is any conversation at all, I object to it. For the best liberty-oriented talk 24-7, visit lrn.fm. What has he said to you that you object to? If there is any conversation at all, I object to it. And to me, it's taunting. Anything that comes out of his mouth is taunting. So no matter what he says to you, it's considered taunting? Correct. So if he made a comment to you about the weather, that would be considered taunting? Oh, well, he doesn't talk to me about the weather. If he did, you would consider that taunting? Coming from him, yes. There, well, there, yeah, there was one where I actually approached him when he made a comment as I walked by him, but that was, um, that was after this, the April 11th event. What comment did he make? He made a comment as I was walking through, walking by Railroad Square, that it must be nice that um, we can walk around with our telephones, and because I'm looking at my phone as I'm walking through, because we have Park Mobile, and I have to look to see if people have paid because there may be um, meters that are blinking, but the person is actually paid for parking through the Park Mobile. And I walked over and showed him my telephone and said, I'm looking at Park Mobile, I'm doing my job, and I kept going. So I understand that even though you were intimidated, I think as you described it on April 11th, you felt comfortable enough with him to approach him and have this subsequent interaction? I didn't feel comfortable enough, but th there are times when you just, uh, you, you've had enough. You're just, just proving to him that I'm doing my job. I'm not Facebooking. LRN.FM, 24 hours of Liberty Radio every day. Now available on satellite too, at sat.lrn.fm. <laughs> That's what a satellite sounds like. Put it on your unlicensed station. Wear it in your hair. But above all, don't despair. The Liberty message is getting out. And right now, you're missing it. Or maybe you're not. But skip on over to LRN.FM. Feds don't want you to hear them.